Hi everybody, uh, my name is Ricky Z, and I'm sitting here with Jess Elaine, and we're playing around with some toys. We've got uh, the Blue Ranger and Carl Martin. A nice little spongy kind of overdrive, ampy kind of vibe to it. They, uh, they, they tell us that it's modeled after that, that Stevie Ray Fender crank was ready to spit speaker fragments. And it kind of has that cool thing to it. It, it gives when you play with it. Let's bring it back down a little bit and see what happens when you have a little bit of gain. Take the drive down. We'll get that amp feel to. So you see it had that kind of old bluesy kind of feel to it, that old Texas thing to it. It was really, really cool. Let's crank up the crank up the drive a little bit. Yeah, there it is, it's alive. And get Really cool. All of a sudden, you get a whole different feel out of the same pedal. The sponge is still there, but it, it just saturates more, which is really, really cool. Myself, I've been messing with it a lot around 12 o'clock inch, so I can back it off when I want to. I love the way it cleans up. So that's usually what I've been doing. Right now we're running through a silver tone 1482, which is just barely on. So if you turn this guy off and here, this is the end. It just kind of allows you to dig into the note a little bit, which is really, really cool. Welcome back. We've been playing around with Carl Martin effects. We just finished up with the Blue Ranger. And now we're going to take a look at the yellow box. Let's go down here, we'll see the TOD, which is their version of the old Boss Turbo Overdrive. With a little, little bit of sexual innuendo. They change things around. They, they want to get the vibe of that pedal played through an old, older Marshall. Perhaps make it the JCM 800 from the 80s. So they took it and they made some changes to make, which make it really a lot more musical than the original pedal from Boss. And we have the you know, the gain drop back a little bit so it's nice and ampy. And with doing that, you can bring your volume back and it's still nice, nice and clean. But if you bring up your volume, hold it, let's go back to it. If you bring up the volume a little bit on your guitar, you get more crunch. Okay, now let's bring up the gain a little bit and see what kind of overdrive we get. So you see it gets real creamy, 
which is really cool. The game structure doesn't change as much, it's just that it just thickens up a little bit, which is really nice. Uh, I've been taking this, this out with me uh, on the road, and in a lot of places, you know, I've been using some AC30s. And, but to keep volume down on stage, what I've been found to do is I'll be using this guy as my, my kind of crunchy tone, where I can get really good, nice breakup at a lower volume. And the trick is, I use this as an amplifier, as it would, because usually when I record things, I'm using, using these guys cranked all the way up. I don't usually use too many effects as far as distortion goes. But when I'm out on the road, we have to keep volume down on stage, so I'll use this guy to sound like this AC50 cranked, or the old Marshall cranked. Now on top of that, I'll just put, for solo, I'll just throw on a treble booster. So. Sudden you get two amps in one one little box. Even when I'm going playing the cleaner stuff, I'll still leave the pedal on. I just back up on the on the volume. Cool, because you don't expect to get that kind of sound out of a overdrive. So there's quite a, there's, there's quite an expanse of variety that you can get with this pedal, which is why I like it a lot. Let's try this guy, this uh, the Gretsch with the Blue Ranger now, because this has a different, totally different feel to it. Although you'll have the same sponge, it's just a different monster altogether. <laughs> Again, it's more of aggressive sound. The, the TOD is a little bit mellower in the response, and the Blue Ranger is just going to have more aggression to it. It's a more big attack to it. Car Martin, making things funky. Okay, let's have a little fun and see how these guys sit in the track. We're going to play some rhythm stuff on the Blue Ranger, and then come back and throw some solo things over with the TOD. Jess? So now we got a little rhythm track down with the Blue Ranger. Gonna switch over to the TOD and throw some fills and solo stuff over it. See what happens. 